We are back with the all-time classic, The Terminator Dawn of Fate, with which Tony and I have both played the hell out of. Yes, uh, many, many, many hours playing Terminator Dawn of Fate. I put over a thousand hours into this game myself. Tony has put in uh, probably more than me. Like 2,000. I mean. 2,000 hours into this game. Okay, we have never played this game before. <laughs> no. I know about the game. I was always interested in it. I think this is the one... There was like a, a commercial for this game where it was like a guy walking across the road and he gets hit by a car. Okay. And you're like, oh wow. And then when he gets up, you realize he's a Terminator. And I, I thought that was that. cool. I don't know if it was for this one, uh, but then I just never played it. So this is our first time trying to play it. And. I imagine it's not going to be very good, but who knows? Hey, who knows? Maybe it's the greatest game of all time. It may be. How many good Terminator games are there? I haven't really played much of them outside of the arcade, the Terminator 2 arcade. Um, I, you know, well, there's a lot of retro ones like NES and yeah. Super Nintendo and stuff like that. I haven't played a lot of them. Oh, Jesus. Every time. Every time it scares me. That Those are bits from Outrise. I, I know what they are. It just scares me every time. Do I do training or do I start and just bitch about the controls? Oh, jump in. Oh, yeah, of course. You do what I do. Yeah, that's how you play games. I don't... Yeah, exactly. If you've learned anything from me, it's it's never read an instruction manual. <laughs> never do any sort of tutorial. <laughs> just get really angry at the game and not know what you're doing <laughs> so that it's completely your own fault. <laughs> That's the way you're supposed to do things. So, uh, Mike, wh what's your favorite Terminator? Um, my, the movie? Yeah. Do you want an aerial answer? Yeah, because like, everyone always knows it's narrowed down to the first two, but... Uh, but but I think the first two had like an alien-alien sort of situation with they're kind of similar, but... Uh, actually, with that, it's probably Terminator 2. Really? No. Yeah. Uh, I always thought the first one had a better story. It probably does. The second one has, like, well, the second one, when you start to think of it, I think John Connor's age is all wrong. Like, yeah. And, like, some of the time travel stuff doesn't make sense, but the first two has better music and better effects. Yeah. By far. But I think the first one is a better. I like the first one a little bit more. Okay. Yeah. Well. I'm kidding. Genesis. Genesis is. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Uh, Gen Genesis was one of the worst movies I've seen in like the last yeah. five years. You know what? I'm having like it's kind of similar with like Alien, where like I thought three and four were bad, but every movie afterwards was so much worse. I appreciate them. Terminator Three, I never like hated that movie, but I knew it was weak. But after like Salvation and Genesis, I'm like you know what? I could enjoy Terminator Three. It's shit, but like I didn't hate Terminator Three actually. Yeah. I thought the thing when they were, when they were going down the road with the crane going. Yeah, and stuff, I, I mean it's at, at the time I they remember didn't, it was they good. didn't need to make it. But well, that's obviously every movie. Not. Yeah. Uh, they don't really need to make any of them. My favorite thing with Terminator 3 is that they made a cutout of Arnold Schwarzenegger, and I've owned it for many, 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 many years. When I lived in uh, North Philly in college, I put it in my apartment just in case anyone ever broke in. They'd see Arnold, and I was hoping it would scare them. Kirak said, play on hard, pussy. No, we're doing medium. <laughs> By the way, I don't know what they're saying right now. We're just going to skip the story. We, we get it. Uh, robots took over. And we got to go. Uh, you're a guy. This is... I, I, I hit. You're a guy. You're in a game. I have two machine guns that I pull out of nowhere. I roll. Oh, I turned to first person? Oh, but oh, I shit. can't move. Uh, what? It would have been cool if it was like that. So you just like... Oh. You can't move like this? No, you can only stay still. Uh, okay. Well, the thing I'm looking forward to with the new movie is I hope it fails so we have the failed to start a trilogy trilogy of Terminator movies. Because the last two movies tried to start a trilogy and they both failed. Well, that Mummy movie was trying to start a franchise. I was trying to start an expanded universe. By the way, I think the anniversary came up of them failing at starting an expanded universe. Okay, there you go. Good. All right. Jeez, took you long enough to figure that out. <laughs> I would have been sitting there for like an hour and a half. <laughs> it would have been like the story. I would have been like, me. anybody in the chat know what to do? It would have been the story you told me about Shadow Colossus where you walk the wrong way. Instead yeah. of going outside the building, you were like, ah, I give up. Uh, yeah, I turned it off. <laughs> you know what my favorite thing about the Terminator movies are? What? All the, all the electric sticks. Yeah, yeah. The electric stick. When you think of Terminator, you think of electric sticks. The first thing, you know. You know what else I like about the Terminator? Blowing up like boxes. Yeah. With your well, guns. You know, I I I'm trying to think what my favorite blowing up boxes scene in the Terminator movies. There's were. so many. There's to just choose. so many to pick from. Yeah. Oh, okay, we gotta kill them all. 
I didn't even know why that was. Why does it have to spin? I don't know. Like that just like makes me kind of thoughts sick. on the new Terminator. Um, the new Terminator. I'm not excited for it. I know James Cameron's helping, but he pretended to like the last two, which got has me worried. I know he's in charge now, but he also hasn't done a movie since Avatar. Like he hasn't. I don't even know if he's produced a movie outside of documentaries. I'm not, I'm not sure. Like I know he's done documentaries. I just don't know if he's produced an actual movie afterwards. He made a theme park at Disney. I know that. Yeah, I'm, but who is the director of the new Terminator? It's the guy who directed the first Deadpool movie, who I guess is fine. But I mean, I just I don't think there's any more anything more you can do with Terminator. Like, you, well, you asked me before if if you know you were given the money. If you were given the money and you had to make a Terminator movie, what would you do? How do you fix it if you have to make a Terminator movie? <sighs> How do you make the best of it? I don't I don't know. I guess you would just do. I would. I guess it would be a prequel, but it'd be in the. I guess what Terminator Salvation was trying to do, where it's like, oh, let's just see John Connor in the future fighting Terminators. Maybe have it lead up to the first movie, kind of like Genesis was trying to do, mm -hmm. but you know, not suck. <laughs> so I, what I would do is, I would have. Uh, I'd, I'd go on eBay and I'd order cardboard cutouts of a T1000 and another one of a, <laughs> a, a you know. Arnold. Well, you don't need to order. I can give you my Arnold cutout. Oh, you have the Arnold. Oh, perfect, yeah. perfect. Yeah. And then, so I'd have you hold the Arnold cutout. Okay. And then, like the the T one thousand, Justin could hold that one, <laughs> and you get you'll be on top of a roof. <laughs> see, this, see where this, this is going? This idea seems very familiar, <laughs> Mike. <laughs> oh shit! I'm gonna mow these guys down. What is up with this fucking character's hair? Oh, this is cool. This reminds me of, like, Gears of War or, like, any kind of war game. This is kind of cool. I like any uh, game that lets you get on one of these, like, railgun things. Well, you know, Tony, games like this make me angry. It's like Donald Duck. He gets real angry. Oh, yeah. At, at, at the Terminator. I found another porn star our audience is a fan of, Mike. I thought you were just all, that, that was going to be the statement. I found another porn star. I found star. another porn star. I'm I was like, like wow. There's more than one. <laughs> wow. You, good job. You found another porn star. Yeah, in the uh, the latest rental review, yeah. I talked about uh, the advertising Godzilla did with the Burj Khalifa Tower in Dubai. You know mm -hmm. the biggest building in the world? It was in Mission yeah, Impossible 4. I do. They, like, I didn't realize there were screens on that building. And they projected like Godzilla and Rodan onto it. It looked really, really, really cool. And in the review, I accidentally called it the Mia Khalifa building. There was a really cool uh, thing, the um, that big building, the uh, the Mia Khalifa building. Who was a former porn star? She was like the biggest porn star of like 2014. <laughs> and everyone in the comments is like, did he just say the Mia Khalifa building? Good job, good job. And I'm like, oh, someone called me a pervert. I'm like, but you all know who she is. <laughs> <laughs> Asking me, what is the worst movie I've seen this year? Uh, I'm trying to think of what I've even seen this year. Um, well, Aladdin, I guess. <laughs> yeah, I guess Aladdin was pretty bad. Um, I don't, I don't know what else I've seen this year. Shit, did I die again? No, no. Okay, I'm still alive. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. It's little mini hunter killers. I'm giving. You know, it's not. A terrible game. It just takes. It doesn't. A while. It doesn't seem terrible. It takes a while to get used to. They look like little Millennium Falcons. And any company. problem with this game is just because of how dated it is. So new Terminator trailer <sighs> came out. I don't care about Sarah Connor coming back. What did you think of that new ter Terminator trailer? Bad. It looked bad. Bad. I like the guy playing the Terminator. He was Ghost Rider in the Ages of Shield. Was there show. Mul was there multiple of that trailer? Or was it just the I one? I think there was just one. So the new Terminator looks like what they should have done with the Terminator in Terminator 3. Remember she was like a robot with liquid metal? But kind of for no reason other than shapeshifting. I like how the robot can take the liquid metal off and it becomes its own Terminator. Okay. In this one, at least there's a reason for liquid metal over the robot. That, that, right, that makes more sense. Because before, it's like, why not just send another liquid metal one? What do you need the robot one for? I, but everything else in the trailer, I do not care about. Like... Sarah Connor coming back, I don't really care. Uh, 
It looks like more of the same. Someone went back in time to save someone. How many times have they done that? How's that new Halloween one that came out? New Halloween one's good. I like the new Halloween. See, that brought back, again, Jamie Lee Curtis, right? Yeah, but it, like, it also like it, it ignored the rest of the continuity. It mm-hmm. kind of started over again. It dropped the it dropped the family thing, so it was able to, like... It kind of told the H2O story, just without all the Halloween 2 stuff attached to it. Is your favorite Halloween 6? <laughs> I did that video with James where, like, it was my favorite Halloween for a bit, because I was an idiot. But, uh, no. Um... One of my favorite things recently uh, is that is that would you say what's your is the Rob Zombie one are those no not at all no no I was saying are those your least favorite oh a hundred percent yeah okay yeah now let me tell you if I was gonna make a Halloween movie yeah here's what I would do yeah I would I'd film it on top of a roof <laughs> I oh, get really I get you over actually I think you'd be oh perfect. wow probably uh, for for Michael Myers I think I'm your first choice that's that's crazy yeah. Um, no, actually, I'm, you'd be Jamie Lee Curtis. <laughs> okay. And but I'm gonna have you hold a cardboard cut out of her. <laughs> uh, and Justin will be. Uh, I'm gonna be on a roof, I guess. I said that. That's where. Oh, we're, okay, uh, okay. We're in the beginning. That's where we're. Oh, okay. some, uh, abandoned roof. <laughs> <laughs> you know, the thing about your movie ideas is that they're all so unique and different. Thank you. <laughs> There's a lot of variety Thank you. in them. I, I really appreciate that. <laughs> and when when people tell me that. I, uh, I I usually agree. <laughs> usually agree. I am fucking get my ass kicked. By the way. Uh, okay, I think we have to switch games. I'm dying a lot. <laughs> no, he means this one. All right, we're gonna switch up games. Uh, this game was fine. Uh, it feels like something I need to pay attention to to like get through, but I think it's okay. It seems like an okay game. It doesn't seem like a great game. It no. seems like a mediocre game. Yeah, yeah. Um, but mostly. I don't think either of us are excited for it. Then I'd rather play this game than watch the new Terminator. I would too, definitely. Yeah. I, I, so I have no interest whatsoever. It probably makes doing these type of videos very difficult with me because I yeah. give a sh- no shits about any oh, of these I, movies. I don't give a shit. I like Terminator, but after like I was hyped for Salvation because that was something I wanted to see, and when that ended up being a letdown, I just stopped caring. Did I, you ever go on the Terminator ride in Universal Studio? Yeah. Remember, I don't think it's there anymore. No, that that one was yeah, it's like a Transformers thing now. That one was fun, but the story didn't make any sense. No. But it didn't matter. It was, it was, it was just, just yeah, funny. I don't know. I just, yeah, yeah. Um, I, think I don't fun. think they need to make any more Terminators. There's nothing left to do there, like yeah. unless you just make it weirder, and they all undermine the ending of two. So I mean, after Genesis, couldn't they just all be like, all right, we should stop? Like yeah. But someone owned the rights. It was one of those things where, like, if you didn't make it, you'd lose it, and someone wanted to make no, money. It's one of these things that's going on with everything. Yeah. That's like, we have a major franchise. We're going to keep yeah. it going forever. Yeah, we don't want to give it back to the people we license. We got to make something. Forget about gi- giving the license yeah. back to anybody. They just need to stop making it. Yeah. Regardless of who owns it, just stop making them. Yeah. But they're not going to do that because there's money to be made. Yeah. I think, if, again, if this one fails, which I wanted to, so we can have the fail to start a trilogy trilogy, I think James Cameron, now that he owns it, and if it fails, he's like, all right, no more. Anyway, we'll see what happens with that. All right, all right we're going to move on to another game, guys. Bye.